Hi there. So in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to extract your data frame to PDF in R. So first thing we are going to do is we are going to install one package named Grid Extra. So go to Tools in your R Studio, then choose Install Package. Here type in Grid Extra and then hit Install. Once you install that, you can call for that library simply type in grid extra okay the next thing to do is call for a data set that you want to use okay in my case I want to use empty cars you can use iris so if you want to use iris simply use data iris or you can also go for library empty cars okay sorry I'm just going to check for empty cars in data okay so next thing I want to set the working directory in my case it is D drive okay now I want to take one variable that will hold entire content value so let's say if I want to use variable name PDF then I can call this PDF method that will hold specific dimensions for PDF you can also use method directly PDF and then say data r dot PDF next thing set the height equals to 11 width equals to let's say 0.5 this is adjusted as per empty cars data table Okay, now I'm going to use grid dot table and I'm going to pass empty cars. Okay, now this data will be added into our PDF and finally when we use div dot off it will be rendered and saved on my device. So let's check that out let's go to d directory and let me check for data r.pdf as you can see empty cars table will be added inside this pdf file okay so as you can see this text is selectable and all the content that we sent from empty cars data rows is added here Okay, so this was a simple tutorial on how you can export a data set value directly into PDF. So use grid.table method for properly printing that data on your PDF document. Okay, you can use Iris database, you can use Trees database, Nile, depending on any that you use from the default set or you can also use your own table just send that to grid.table and finally render it with dev.off okay so this is the code for exporting data to pdf file in r